Greetings and welcome to the introduction to astronomy. One of the things that I like to do in each of my introductory astronomy classes is to begin the class with the astronomy picture of the day from the NASA website that is apod.nasa.gov apod. And today's picture for February the 24th of 2021. Well, it is titled Spiral Galaxy M66 from Hubble. So what do we see here? Well, this is an example of a spiral galaxy, and it is from the constellation of Leo and part of the Leo galaxy triplet. So three galaxies relatively close together, separated by about the diameter of our full moon. So you can see uh, see them very close together here. We're looking at just one of them as imaged by Hubble Space Telescope. And we look out at it and we see the distinct signs of star formation that are associated with spiral galaxies. Now we can see three different things here that associate this with star formation. One is the dark dust lanes, which is where material is being hidden. So they're dark, denser areas where stars are just beginning to form. Outside of that, we see some blue stars, clusters of blue stars, which are relatively young stars. Now we know that they're young because blue, these hot blue stars only live for a short time. So if they can only live five or 10 million years, then they must have formed within the last five or 10 million years. Otherwise, they would no longer be around. So the fact that we see them means that star formation in this galaxy, like our own, has been going on relatively recently. The galaxy may be 10 billion or so years old, but the stars are only 10 million years old, 1 1,000th the age of the galaxy. So they must have formed within the last 1 1,000th the age of the galaxy itself. Now the other thing that we see here are the pink hydrogen regions off to the left hand side and then off to the right as well. Those are regions of hydrogen gas. Now hydrogen is normally a clear gas and you could see right through it. However, when it is excited by ultraviolet radiation from hot stars which have formed, it excites the gas and causes it to glow much as neon glows in a neon tube and a neon sign. So here hydrogen is glowing in the same way and when hydrogen glows, it gives off a distinct red color that we see as pink here in our ga in this galaxy. Now, if a distant astronomer in this galaxy could look back at our own Milky Way, they might see something quite similar to this. They would see the same signs of star formation that we see from inside, but would be able to look down at our galaxy and see them and be able to see the different processes of star formation, just like we see here that our own galaxy and in fact, all spiral galaxies go through. So it is a common thread among spiral galaxies that they are all have relatively recent star formation and that differentiates them from things like elliptical galaxies, which underwent a massive burst of star formation maybe 10 billion years or so ago and used up all of their gas and dust and no longer form stars. So when we look at those galaxies, we see no uh, blue stars, we see no pink hydrogen regions, and we see no dark dust lanes, as we're used to seeing in spiral galaxies like the one we're looking at today, which was M66 as seen by Hubble Space Telescope. So that was our picture of the day for February the 24th of 2021. It was titled Spiral Galaxy M66 from Hubble. We'll be back again tomorrow for the next picture. So until then, have a great day everyone, and I will see you in class.